welcome to The Fumble. I'm Britt Johnson. Follow me on social media at I am Britt Johnson and click subscribe to The Fumble if you haven't already. It seems like the NFL drama is never ending. Today, the NFL and NFL PA claim that Panther safety Eric Reed was lying when he said he has been targeted seven times this season when the NFL made him do random drug tests. Each player receives at least one random drug test a year, but the thought of Reed receiving six just seemed very odd, especially considering that Reed filed an official grievance letter with the NFL alleging that team owners and the league, influenced by Trump, colluded to prevent his employment due to his protest activities. Reed, along with former teammate Colin Kaepernick, participated in protests in order to highlight racial injustice towards people of color. Ian Rappaport tweeted this out on Wednesday. More on the independent administrator's report on Eric Reed's drug test claims. Source said it was determined that Reed was drug tested fewer times than he publicly claimed. So Eric may have exaggerated on the number of times that he was actually tested, but is it true that the NFL is not just randomly selecting him, they are actually targeting him? Well, according to Stephen A. Smith, hell yeah they are. Stephen A. Smith went on to say that the NFL owners are billionaires and they are using politicians to help them gain access to NFL betting among other things. At the time of filming, the report didn't confirm how many times exactly Reed was actually tested, but the NFL claims they have done as many as six tests per year for one player alone. Well, NFL PA, it's time for you guys to step up once negotiations start and make sure the NFL has a limit put on the number of times they can test the player like they do in the NBA because it seems like it wasn't a coincidence that Eric has this suit against the NFL and it just so happens he's been tested more than several times, whether it's seven or three or whatever. It's more than the regular number of times and he didn't even play a full season. So, do you guys think the NFL is targeting Reed? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Don't forget to like this video, click subscribe, and shop the Fumble store for the latest game day gear. I'm your host, Britt Johnson for the Fumble, and I'll see you real soon.